And a look at the uh, main concourse at Whataburger Field where folks get a chance to meet and greet. It's a real community-type atmosphere here at Whataburger Field. It really is. It's a little bit uh, more relaxed and, and in a way I think more fun, at least more lighthearted than what you might experience in a big league game where there's a little bit more noise. It's a little more electric. And here's Mitchell Boggs in the pitch now, a representative for the Springfield Cardinals. Six and three record this season. There's Nucci Varner, who's two for two, taking this pitch for a strike. Varner doubled and scored back in the second and singled in the fourth. Well, Nucci's getting three at bats. He had quite a few home runs in that home run derby, too. He was uh, up there in the uh, home run count. He had 14. He was tied for second. Chopper up the middle. There's base knock number three for Nucci Varner. <laughs> he hit one hard. He looped one over the first baseman's head, and then he chopped one up the middle. Sometimes it's not always how hard you hit it. It's where you hit it. And that's the way he plays all season long. When you watch your teams defense him, they play straight up, straight up in the infield and straight up in the outfield. There you see Richie Robnett hitting one just above the yellow line off the railing for a two-run home run back in the second to give the South a 2-0 lead. Now the other home runs are the same way. Both home runs in this game uh, would probably not be home runs uh, in most parks on most days. As Rob Nett comes up again here and takes this pitch for a strike, that home run back in the second. Last time up, he had a bullet right to short. And this pitch is low. One ball, one strike to count. I think that home run that Morrissey hit was a line drive homer, too. Both probably would have been hits because they were line drives. It would have been doubles probably most of the time, not home runs. Two and one now the count to Richie Robnett. And this one low one in to make it three balls and one strike. Foul tip here, caught by the yeah. new catcher in the game. That's uh, Bobby Wilson of the Arkansas Travelers that's uh, back there behind the plate. There's a smash up the middle. Stopped there by Morrissey, a one-hot throw to first. Picked out of the dirt by Stadalka to get Rob Nett as uh, Varner advances to second on the play. Great uh, defense at both ends of that play. Yeah, and, and not such good base running because... It seemed like Rob Nett uh, assumed that that ball was going to go through in the right field because he started to to go out, veer off the line in order to make the turn of first. Then he had to come back to the bag. Probably cost him a step and may have cost him a hit. And uh, coming up to bat here, Brian Snyder. Snyder came in defensively earlier, batting for the first time. Came in to replace Drew Sutton, 286 hitter for the year. There's a fly ball toward the right field corner. This ball's dying, and it lands for a base hit. Varner is held up at third as Miller gets that ball back into the infield quickly, so it's a single for Snyder inside the right field line in the south with runners at the corners and one out for Bo Torber. Kind of a situational uh, move for Dave Clark coaching third base in this game because normally a guy on second is going to score on this base hit. But the guy on second, either thinking it might be foul or he's thinking it might be caught, and so he doesn't take off with the crack of the bat. And with one out, he, he might have been able to score, but with one out, you're thinking, I don't want to get the guy thrown out at home with one out because we can get him in with a fly ball or a weak ground ball or squeeze play, any number of things, pass ball, wild pitch. And so you he probably waves him home with two outs, but with one out, he does not. Bo Torbert batting for the first time. He came on back in the fifth out in left field and 
Takes the 0-1 pitch downstairs. One ball, one strike. Runners at first and third. One out for the south. South up by a run. Swing and a miss here by Bo. And the count, one ball and two strikes. So Bo had a great game here last Thursday. First homer of the season, four RBIs and a hooks route of Frisco. And the next day he was up in AAA and he's uh, back here for the All-Star game. This pitch in the dirt, two and two the count. Yeah, some of these guys are probably wondering, you know, I've got 10, 12 home runs. He hits one home run and they call him up. Well, he's done a lot more than hit one home run. Here's a hot shot down to third. Christian Colonel up with it. Goes to second for one. Morrissey to first. Double play. And around the horn, double play started by Christian Colonel will wrap up the south's bottom of the sixth inning. No runs. A couple of hits. One man left. We head to the seventh inning from Whataburger Field. The south three, the north two. 